Hey, what's up guys? Sadness here. Welcome back to the channel. Today we're hopping back into some more Fallout 3. Now the last we left off, we completed the quest for, what's it called, Grey Ditch. We cleared out those ants, and we also did the next step of the Wasteland Survival Guide. So I think we're just going to keep going on with this quest. We're going to go try to install the processor widget in the Robco Production Facility mainframe. Now, here's the thing, right? We've been down bad on weapons, so I'm going to keep this Deathclaw Gauntlet on me just in case I run out of ammo. Uh, and I'm hoping for Welcome the best here. Now, the main problem that... All of us here thank you for everything you've done. For us. For the wastes. We pulled together and got you this. It's the best we could do. A new Coca-Cola you shouldn't have. Certainly. It's the least I could do after all you've done. I think my character loves new Coca-Cola, so I think we're pretty happy about that. Hello? Hello, is it me you're looking for? Sorry. I have to. Now you die. I heard a sound. Oh, shoot. Is that what I heard? Is that Did I just hear him die as we left? This, wait, does he die if you don't give him water? Hold up. I'm going to search it real quick. Oh, shoot. I, oh, shoot. I'm messing up my recording. That's not what I meant to do. Okay, here we go. Let's look it up real quick. I guess he does die if you don't give him water. Remember when I said I gave him some water and then I told him to go out on his own and figure out how to get himself some water? Clearly he didn't listen, he kept begging and it was the death of him. Welcome to Not my fault, I tried to help the man once, you know? Hopefully my audio is fixed on this, I do apologize for the last recording. I don't know if it was just me when I was listening back to it or if you guys noticed too. It seemed pretty... Oh, shoot, that scared me. Ah! It seemed pretty quiet, didn't it? I should use my laser pistol for now. First off, why is it not on... Put this on three. Alright. So. Yeah, I don't know if it was me or if it was just... Uh, me overthinking it, but the audio seemed quiet, so I messed around with it, and I'm hoping that it's better now. So do let me know if it sounds better in the comments, or if it sounds the same to you, but... Either way, I tried my best. I'm gonna make sure I get some recorded for you guys. Let's drink this new Coca-Cola. You wanted water, maybe you should've just drank some new Coca-Cola, you know? I do need to sell the Enclave armor too. So we're heading to Rob Co. This should be interesting. I'm hoping we'll find a lot of fusion cells there. Who are you guys? There's no sense in trying to fix this heap of junk. Damn it. Oh, hey there. Do you need something? Something wrong with your robot? I've been wondering about that for an hour now. I think it's stuck in some sort of loop. I tried fixing it, but all those switches and circuits are beyond me. You can try to fix it for you. Thanks. If you get it working, I have a couple of energy cells you can have. Just come back to me when you're done. Sounds good. All right. Fix that robot, and I'll give you some energy cells. Good luck. It's just what I need, honestly. I give up. Oh, repair of 40. What's my repair skill? 35 rip. You're not getting any more fixed with me just talk. Hello again. Let I wanted to repair my death claw on 75 caps. Screw it. And 
Maybe I can sell him that power armor now. I wonder why the Deathclaw Gauntlet only sells for a little bit. My question is, does he have something that can raise my... Alright. Thanks. I'll come back. Don't worry, guy. Hopefully he's still there by the time we get back. Headshots. Bats is so good. Well, that's a flamer person. Easy. You guys didn't stand a chance. Oh, perfect. I leveled up. You know what? Let's get explosives to 60 and I want to get medicine to 60. I'm kind of thinking about taking Nerd Rage, I'm not going to lie. Let's do it. I don't think I've ever taken that one. So if my health drops any lower, then I'll get a bonus. That could be useful. Yes? Uh, re rewire the diagnostic system. You reset the circuitry inside, inside the robot, it should behave normally. Hey, what happened with the robot? I fixed it. Thanks. Nice to meet a fellow mechanic out here in the wasteland. Here's your payment. Two energy cells. What is it now, sir? Man, ripped me off. You're lucky I'm a good guy or I'd murder you. It's a garbage. Dude, how are you gonna give me two energy cells? I wasted skill points to repair your robot, sir. It's so funny, this follow through reminds me of Oblivion, like with the whole you're just traveling, the music's going. Instantly you can see something spot you from like a mile away and then cuts off because the you know other after you. What's this guy? Brotherhood Outcasts. I seen him kill a Protectron. Where'd you kill that? Back off, local. Hey, local. Shouldn't you be banging rocks together or something? Hey, local. Shouldn't you be banging rocks together Bro. or something? Bro. Don't act like I'm dumb. First of all. Secondly. I'm gonna save everybody, so you need to chill, my dude. I also need to go to Rivet City for, uh, Brian. What is this place, though? Guess I could go in to discover it. Hello? Help me get my bonus, lady. Fairfax. Oh, 
<laughs> Why? We're all the way back here now. Oh yeah, I'm literally... <laughs> I'm literally at the city again, rip. I don't know, man. I think I'm gonna head around a little bit for now. I don't know what city this is. Oh yeah, we, we actually did discover it. It was, uh, Fairfax. Not a legit city, though, because there's raiders all around. I will head up to this building, though. I like to explore, like, my surroundings while I'm traveling. But at the same time, if I know I'm gonna insta-die, then we'll wait on certain places. Fairfax has to be for a quest, right? I wonder what that sound was. Sounded like someone shot something out. Oh my gosh, a Yao Guai? That's not good. That's not good at all. I feel like I've never even seen a Yao Guai in this game legitimately. I've seen him in like Fallout 4, but not this game. Holy. Guy looks creepy in this game. Plus 10% damage in case I'd need some extra damage boost. Another one? Jeez, bro. Come on, Mr. Mr. Stranger. We need your help. Man's gonna come only when we don't need him. Like on this mole rat. Could have taken my could have taken my repellent. Robco's probably gonna be difficult, seeing it was a, it was a main corporation. Like if people knew about it from the old world, then yeah, they definitely would have looted it. Brad Squirpy. I hate how they're smart enough to run away if they can't get you. man said, let me unload a whole mag. Bro, you had him dead on the first shot. Probably Robco right there. Yep, it <laughs> literally says it. Ah, uh, yes. Critical sneak attacks. I guess all sneak attacks are criticals. You know what I mean. Feels good, especially when they get incinerated. This laser rifle's great, though, I gotta say. Is that already a Protectron I see? Well, it's a few. I'm gonna go check. I'm gonna save it since I'm here, because... I'm not trying to make you guys watch me walk all the way back again. Hey guys, you're speedy. Wait up. heck is that place? Oh, is that the place where you watch the nuke get blown up? Another glorious day in this man's army. Hello, stranger. I'm Tinker Joe, premier supplier of robotic parts and service throughout the DC wasteland. Like to buy a robot? What are you selling? Have a look and see for yourself. Wow, such good stuff. He even has 30 whole caps to spend. I'll give you a deal, buddy. Another satisf- 
I'm afraid these bots are all spoken for. I'm just delivering them now. I've got a custom gutsy that isn't spoken for, but... Well, RL3's a bit finicky about the company he keeps, and I don't think he likes the look of you. Nothing personal, of course. What do you mean, bro? I gotta go check this place out, though. I wonder if they're gonna be hostile towards me because I killed what's his name and Megaton. I forget his name, but you know, the evil dude. Tenpenny Tower. You can tell Tenpenny he can kiss my ass. We've got plenty of bottle caps. Let me in, goddammit. How many times do we have to go through this? You're not getting in. I can stand here all day yelling at you through this damn speaker if I have to. I've already told you Tenpenny won't allow zombies to live here. Thanks. Who the hell are you calling a zombie? You're definitely not human, that's for damn sure. For the last time, no zombies allowed. Can't you tell the difference between me and a feral? Fine, I'll show you the goddamn difference. Just you wait. You'll get yours, all of you. <laughs> I'm really not in the mood, so leave me alone. I'm really not in the mood. Oh, I was so gonna help you out. What do you mean? I thought I told you to get the hell out of here. Tenpenny doesn't want your goddamn caps, and I don't want the goddamn headache. For the last time, get your rotten, ugly, goddamn ghoul ass off Mr. Tenpenny's private property. You treat your mother. <laughs> do you kiss your mother with that mouth? Sorry about that. I thought you were one of those damn ghouls looking for a handout. You are currently trespassing on Alistair Tenpenny's private property. Do you have some reason to be here? Here to see Tenpenny. <laughs> That's rich. What would a man like Tenpenny want to do with a waste rat like you? Tenpenny's expecting me I'm a new talent. Nice try, kid. I know everyone who lives here, even the new ones. It's my job, and I hey. take my job very seriously. It's also my job to deal with anyone I consider a threat to Mr. Tenpenny or his property. Feel free to stand there all day. I don't care. Oh, come on, let me in. Pretty please with, a sh with sugar on top. Mm. Unless by sugar you mean to sweeten my day with, say, a gift of a hundred caps. Open the door. Maybe you'll fit in around here better than I thought. All right, I'll take your money. But don't press your luck. I got my eye on you. And don't bother Tenpenny or the other residents. If you so much as sneeze in the wrong direction, I'll gut you. How did he get my Welcome camps? to Ten Penny Tower. Don't do anything stupid. How did he get my caps already? I wasn't even in. Alright, these guys clearly seem like jerks. I'm just gonna go look around and see what we got. Hi. That's supposed to be super- oh my gosh, that scared me, bro. Chill out. Door to Metro Access and Generator. Yeah, I'm gonna go mess with Tenpenny right away. I'm gonna go see what he has to say to me. Hey. No way it was him talking to us. It doesn't even sound the same. Definitely looks good in here. I wonder if we could help could have helped those ghouls. I mean I tried, he didn't even want to talk to me, so.
You may be saying, I thought your character was a good guy. Yeah, but these guys seem like jerks. And it's like, I'm not gonna... By good, I mean I'm not gonna just straight up go around murdering everyone. Um, I don't necessarily mean I'm not gonna ever steal anything. Plus, I need to figure out if these guys are jerks or not. And get my money back, of course. Yes, that's locked. And yes, I can see you eyeing it. Oh, you didn't see nothing, right? Ah, hello. Tenpenny Tower is a wonderful place to live, isn't it? Lydia? Oh, I can't believe it. With all of Gustavo's goons running around, they still let thieves come into my store and take things. I thought I was safe here. That's it. I'm leaving. I'll try my luck elsewhere. Haha. <laughs> Where will I go? Wait, is what well, this was her shop? Is that a hula girl? Hold up, I wanna go see if I if she has the key to that. Resident. I don't think she has the key that I wanted, but let's go see if we can bother him. Mr. Tenpenny isn't taking callers. I'm here to see Tenpenny, but if you weren't so incompetent, you'd know that. Hold on there a minute. Oh, all right, I'll let you in, but if Tenpenny hollers because he isn't expecting you, you're dead. Um, okay. I didn't mean to be so rude to you, sir, but... <laughs> Thanks for the key, bud. Like, yeah, we want to be a good person, but we also want to make sure that people aren't just... evil themselves, you know? Speech increased by one. Hope that's not blood. Oh, this doesn't even give you radiation? Oh, they must have good water then. Fancy that! A visitor! I seldom get visitors, which is a tiresome shame, because I'm usually relentlessly bored out of my right mind. All of these confounded people fluster about like I'm made of eggshells and about to fall to pieces in any moment. I'm surprised they even let you in. So, what do you think of my fine tower here? It's quite the jewel of the wasteland, isn't it? I dare say I'm quite proud of it myself. Indeed, I'm extremely impressed. Right, oh, when I saw this place jutting up out of the horizon, I knew what I had to do. I hired some muscle, and we got this place fixed up right quick. I had the great fortune to run into Mr. Burke, an absolute gem of a man. He certainly has a way of getting done what needs to get done, doesn't he? Then it was a matter of getting the right type of tenants with the right type of assets, and the rest is, as they say, history. What a tower you have here. Some might say Tenpenny Tower is my crowning achievement, but no. No, no, my dear boy, it is just the beginning. Tell me about yourself. Oh, it's impolite for a gentleman to talk about himself, but I'd hope this magnificent tower would speak volumes. Man, he doesn't have anything to say to us. Inaccessible more. Empty sweet. Now's not the best time. Perhaps we could parlay. Sometime 
later, and thank you. So I don't really have any reason to take him out, you know what I mean? This technically I don't even think our character would know that this was where Burke was from, but he does know that they seem like jerks. I'm going to bed. I am Comrade Cheng, beloved leader of the people, shining servant of the community. How can I help you? Uh, it's nice to meet someone with a sense of civic. Thanks, Comrade. I'm sure you'll agree that people are only as strong as their leader. That's why I do my best to serve the community to the fullest. Speaking of service to the community, I don't suppose you are familiar with ghouls, are you? More importantly, how to kill them? I formed a committee to investigate the problem. Um... It will take more than a committee to deal with the problem. No. Don't worry about the ghouls. Perhaps you're right. My wife is always going on about how crazy I make her. What's it like living here? Well, comrade, things are great. The best of the best have made a community here. Well, there is that problem with the ghouls, but I think it'll be solved soon enough. What do you think about the whole situation with the ghouls? I'm sure it will end in bloodshed. It's serious business, comrade. Perhaps, comrade, the ghouls will join your committee. Are you mocking me, comrade? Hmm. Alright, so I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go try to talk to those ghouls and see what they want. I'll probably deal with this um, little thing and then if it lets me anyways. How do I get out of here? Yes. Well, I got a 100 cap profit. I'm going to go see what these... I seen him walk over this way, so he's gotta be around here somewhere. See if I can help these unfortunate people out. Main problem is I don't really know where they went. Guess I could have taken the quest, but then probably not helped them. Maybe they're over here. This place seems important. I'm either thinking here or over there. Where are you at, ghouls? Feral. So they're probably not here, because that guy wasn't a feral, obviously. to help him but he wouldn't talk to me. Railway spikes. Something's radioactive here. Is there a glowing one or something? Oh shoot, I fell. There's a glowing one. Shoot. Hopefully the mysterious stranger will help us out here. I killed that guy. These guys should be easy enough then. Bottle. 
caps. Is that what was giving me radiation? Was the ghoul? No, something here is radioactive. Technically, all this metal would be, right? Yeah, I'm trying to see where that guy went, because... Definitely know he was he went, walked this away, but yeah, this will help us save ammo. This death claw gauntlet. I kind of want to go explore this. I get sidetracked very easily and I do apologize, but if there's anything specific you guys want me to do that I forget or you want me to just speed up the pace towards certain things, just let me know. Assault rifle. I'm wondering if this goes to the underground by Tenpenny, but... Find out. So much radioactive waste. Didn't they just explode? Definitely need to heal now. Probably shouldn't use that unless I'm down bad, because... If I don't use that, then I'm going to be running out of... I'm going to be running out- or, yeah, running out of stim packs. So I really just got to choose between stim packs and ammo at this point. I wonder if there's going to be a railway rifle down here because... I keep seeing railway spikes. Oh, you're strong. Here, another one on its way. I'm gonna try and loot while I have the chance. Ooh, 42 energy cells. Ah, dude, you scared me. I heard you coming, but I'm so scared. Oh, jeez. Bats is so nice. Helps you stay calm in the tough moments. Where did I kill the other one? Braddock. So that leads into the same room. Put my pit boy light on. Two shot him. All right, cool. Hope you guys are all having a good weekend. It's the weekend for me, at least. I don't know when I'll post this, but it's not the weekend when you watch this. I hope you have a good week. I keep breaking my limbs. I'm a very frail boy. Looking to see if there's anything significant around. Can't even go that way.
Ghouls usually don't have anything on them worth even picking up. Maybe we'll find that other dude. getting to about 45 minutes in the recording right now. I'm gonna try and finish this spot before I wrap it up. Of course we missed that one last shot. If we would have hit that shot, they would have been dead. Blue pass card. Seems like something I need. What was that? Did I shoot something explosive or something? What did that simp? Hmm. Oh well, it worked out for me. Hello? Ooh, meds. You know what I really like right now are some explosives. Got a paint gun rip. Scared me. I'm gonna say this is where I came from. What did I where did I hear that come from? It, it delayed like it wasn't gonna kill him, but it did. Bro, where did you even come from? Huh, that was weird. Revolution starts here. What? You there! Put your weapons away! Come over here! No funny business, unless you wanna get shot. Okay, dude. I think we might have found who I was hoping to find. What are you doing here? It's not safe for your kind around here. Michael Masters. Uh, I'm here to see Roy Phillips. Oh yeah? Is he expecting you? Well then, run along. It's not wise to keep Roy waiting. Has a bit of a temper, that one. You watch yourself. Thanks, dude. Good. steal from these guys. Like, that's what I mean with the whole, like, you know, morality part of our character. Like, these guys, we can tell they're down bad. I'm not trying to steal. I mean, I could be down bad too, but... Wait, where is this guy? Got a quest. Where's he even at? Roy. Where did he even go? Oh, here we go. Maybe? I'm confused. I don't even know where the other guy went. Oh yeah, here he is. Yes. 
Just looking for Roy. Yes. Hello, Bessie. Oh, hello. I'm Bessie Lynn. I... I don't think you should be down here. Did you talk to Roy? I, I hope you know what you're doing. You could get in a lot of trouble by coming around uninvited. Don't worry about me, I'll be fine. I wouldn't want to see anyone get hurt. You must be pretty tough to get past all the ferals. They tend to leave us alone, but someone like you... Am I babbling again? Roy tells me I shouldn't do that. Alright. Looking for Roy. I don't know where he is. Roy! What do you want? Killed a bunch of crazy ghouls in the Metro Tunnels. So you killed a bunch of feral ghouls. Is that supposed to sound impressive? I got no compassion left for those mindless freaks. But they were a nice deterrent keeping out smooth-skinned bastards like yourself. What are you doing in the Metro Tunnels? Biding our time, making plans, getting ready. Tenpenny and his pack of elitist wannabes can't keep us out of that tower forever. We've got rights, and we'll take them if they aren't given to us. You're secure in the tunnels, why do you want to get in there anyways? Ghouls aren't built for luxury and comfort, is that it? You think ghouls belong scurrying around in that dark, dank, underbelly of the wasteland? You got a lot of nerve. Oh, well, that's not what I meant. Bill. No. Might be able to help you get in there. I already got a plan. They think I'm a monster? I'll show them the real monsters. We'll unleash our feral brethren on them. All those bigoted sons of bitches will get torn apart. Trouble is getting past the damn subway access door. You see this? Some kind of escape door that leads from the Tenpenny basement to the subway tunnels. There must be some way to get that open. Mm -hmm. Technically, I'd say he's not better than Tenpenny. If I'm no better than Tenpenny, then he should let me into that tower. But he won't, so I'm busting in. I already will unleash. I know I'm not going to be able to talk to him. You know it's great. Let's help the ghouls. Now you're talking my language. All right, here's the plan. I'll gather up a horde of ferals and wait for you by that escape door. You find a way to get it open, and then we'll sit back and enjoy the show. Try it if you like. Go talk to Tenpenny. Ask him if he wants us living there. It won't work. So when you fail, we can do it my way. Alright, I guess I'll try to do it the good way because, you know... I try I'm trying to be a good character. Is there an easy way out of here? Hmm. I don't think there's gonna be an easy way out. That'd be nice. Then we can head over to Ten Penny Tower in the next episode. This has to be leading into the very hard containment door. So that's where that's where Ten Penny Tower is. And I can't pick the lock on it. There's no terminal to hack. We're kind of screwed in that regard. Alright guys, I'm going to wrap this episode up here. I'm probably going to get out of here and go to Tenpenny Tower and then I'll start the next episode. 
But I hope you guys all enjoyed this episode, and if you have any comments, let me know down below about what you think, how you think I should keep going about with my character, how we should react to the world, things like that. Leave a like if you enjoyed, and subscribe if you want to see more, and I will see you guys next time. Have a good day, guys.